Yes, I'll be. All right, your timer starts now. One moment, sorry, my, I have to plug in my computer real quick. Um, okay, I'm ready. Okay, your timer starts. Can you imagine a world where you can do anything, or you could be anything? You can do magic, you can make stories, or you can go on any adventure that you probably can't do at your age right now. Well, I've seen these worlds, or really, I've read about them. I'm referring to books, if you haven't noticed yet. See, I love reading. It is my most favorite hobby, and I believe that reading could really impact everybody's lives. Now, when I talk about reading, personally, I mostly talk about fantasy books because that is by far my favorite genre, fantasy books all the way. But reading comes in other forms too, like nonfiction books. There's so many different books where you can read about inspirational people or uh, inventions that have occurred over time or ways different situations have impacted our world. There's books about climate change, there's books about animals, or if you wanna go another route, there's books about mysteries and fiction. Anything you can think of, you would probably be able to find in a book somewhere. All you have to do is look for it. I absolutely love books and I think everybody should be reading books. Maybe not all the time, but if it was me, I would totally want to read all the time. But I think books are more, this can be a little controversial, but I think books are much better than movies just because books let you imagine the world that you're reading. Movies, they show it all out for you. And it's pretty cool to look at sometimes, like all of these effects and sound effects and music. It's all really well and well done, but books they let you imagine what you want to imagine how you imagine that world is unique to you and that's what makes books special but in that same way nonfiction books can be amazing there's so many people i've met who have been impacted by the stories of so many successful people and some of these stories were literally books that they went to the library or the bookstore picked it up and they read it and so the reason why I'm telling you this, first of all, because reading is my favorite hobby and I love talking about it. I can talk about it for hours, but also because I want to urge you guys to read books as well. Now, I know some of you guys might be like, uh, no, I don't like books, but I don't think it's a bad idea to maybe look at some books, maybe pick out one or two and just flip through it because you never know what you might find. So with that, I want to end by saying, there's so many different inspiration, so many different worlds you can visit through books. And I hope to see you guys there. Thank you. Sorry, I just realized. Um, <laughs> we'll start the one minute um, feedback in the chat. And then after me, by the way, is Hasni. And also try to do one thing you liked and one area of improvement.
one minute is over. Awesome. Okay. So our next speaker is Hasni. Hi. So before I start my speech, or like, I guess. Um, I didn't time it yet. Um, that's not me. Okay. Good. 